Today's beer is Stone IPA. Welcome to Ruby Reviews Books. Reviews from a cat who cannot read. From a cat who cannot read. Welcome to Ruby Reviews Beers. Reviews from a cat who cannot read. To Ruby Reviews. To Ruby Reviews Beers. Welcome to Ruby Reviews Beers, because I can't read a book every week. She may not like to booze, but she sure knows her brews. Today's beer is Stone IPA from Stone Brewing out of sunny Southern California. Hailing from the granddaddy of West Coast IPA styles, Stone exemplifies the in-your-face, middle fingers in the air, craft till you die, anti-corporate mentality that brings a smile to my face, even if I am not usually over fond of extraordinarily hoppy beers. This classic pours cloudy amber gold with a thin head that quickly settles. The nose on it is unapologetically hoppy, like a pine forest cut with a little citrus. The, oh, hey cat. The first sip is an in-your-face punch of bitters, followed by light notes of lemon and cut grass. It has a clean, medium body feel to it, but it's the piney hops that grab you and never let you go. The finish is bitter long after you set the bottle down in a way that says this is the beer you're drinking, the only beer you're drinking. Normally this would bother me, but Stone captures this essence so well that I'm happy to sit back and let the beer drive my palate. While not my favorite style, it's emblematic for an IPA, the kind of beer that is a template for new microbrews putting together their first India Pale Ale. I give it four stars out of five. Ruby gives it a sniff and a lick of the chops. Happy drinking. She may not like to food, but she sure knows her brews. She may not like to food.